Guys, we are back with a quick little tutorial. This is how to get the manual transmission and use your steering wheel and pedals and shifters in 5M, specifically 5M. However, it does obviously work in GTA 5 single player. But today I'm going to show you how to put it in 5M. So get this downloaded, then inside it's pretty damn simple. Inside our, let's go to our 5M install. Mine is on my desktop somewhere. So this is where I downloaded 5M and installed 5M. Inside the 5M application data, you should have a plugins folder. If you haven't got a plugins folder, create a plugins folder. Then in here I have the actual gears.asi and the manual transmission folder. So they're from the download of the page I just showed you. I'll put the link down below. So this is credit to IKT who made this mod. It's uh, you've been seeing the videos. It's pretty damn sick. So this is how I've been using my um, steering wheel, shifter, pedals, etc. With this mod. And all I do, I download it. And then inside I put the uh, manual transmission folder and gears.asi in the 5M application data plugins folder. Like I say, create that folder if you haven't got one. You should have one. Right, once you've done that, go into your game. So let's go into 5M. So I'm going to come off that server. I was on a testing server in a second. Let's come off that and let's open up. Doo -doo -doo. There we go. Let's get another one up. Doo -doo -doo. There we go. And we'll quickly jump on the free roam. However, I haven't got my steering wheel and stuff set up right now, but. This is the same general concept. So let's go history. Let me quickly find my free roam server. If you want access to this free roam server, which is only going to be getting better, boys, and there's somebody on there now driving around, then just, yeah, message me on Discord. Send me your Steam ID 64. I'll get you on. It is whitelisted because you have to let people use mod menus, the script talk, etc. Um, on here. So, yeah, there is a whitelist. But once we're on, you have to press the bracket key, which is the key to the right of P. The key to the right of P, bracket, just press that key and it should give us our controls. I'll show you how to quickly set yours up. Do, 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 do. And believe it or not, it's a lot better than you think driving around in GTA 5. Pretty awesome. Okay, should be. There's, there's only cars on this server, so we should be straight on. There we go. Thank you, please. Right, so let's get in our car. Car R33, for instance. Absolute spaceship. Oh, there we go. Right, so if I press the bracket, the, the key next to P, I now have this menu. So enable the manual transmission. I put mine on H pattern. I'll just take you through my quick controls. Then go to controls here. The wheels and pedals. Enable your wheel. And then what you can do as well is go to the button input setup. You go sign all this down here, so you press the right right arrow key, so I'd click it, and then yeah, or right arrow to clear it, click it to go and set a, a new button. Um, everything's in here, or you can do your shifters automatics, the analog input setup, configure the brakes, configure all your setup basically is in here. And uh, one of the main reasons I use this at the minute is for my camera. So when I'm inside, for my first person, I can maneuver. Um, where I'm sitting etc but yeah that's the mods I use hopefully it's simple as you just get those two the file and the folder and you put them into your plugins in your 5 ram application data folder yeah pretty simple come in and press the bracket get in the car press the bracket and set up your wheel and your shifter you should be cooking on gas hope it helps guys hope to see you on the free roam server it is only a work in progress at the minute but yeah there's a lot of cars in here you can come and drive that's with your wheel and your shifter that's the main thing Take care, boys. Peace. Be with you. Stay safe.